uh, things are moving along. I had to pull some of the uh, greens from this one and let the brassicas go. These guys are doing great. The peas are coming in. They're going to come out as soon as they fruit, um, which they're doing right now. I got another couple of days before I can pick it. There's the herb box, uh, and these are the peas, superstars right now. Uh, yeah, they're just uh, about to go. And this is the farm. Um, eggplants are in. Uh, I got a couple other things planted, but it's eggplants, uh, squash, and cucumbers, peppers, 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 lots of peppers. Um, box over here has got beets in it that are going to come out in a couple weeks. Uh, which will let the tomatoes just go to town. Uh, there's that blue box that's doing really well. Uh, really the best tomato I have right now. Again, I think it has to do with the fact that the water container is uh, very big. It's perforated, so a lot of air gets through when the water isn't full and the reservoir's not, not filled completely most of the time. So it gets a lot of air on the roots. I'm hoping the bags do kind of the same thing. I'm gonna have to figure out how to keep those watered because it does get hot up here. But um, I hope the uh, air pruning on the roots kind of kind of works in those bags. But we'll find out. Carrot box, um, squash, cucumbers over there. A uh, couple more um, boxes of beets and peppers and beets and peppers and squash. Brassicas over there, and then a couple of random and um, bags and containers so there we go it's uh, it's growing a lot uh, and it's just ready to go so I'm very excited about what's going on here bye